ChatGPT is a very powerful tool, but the outputs are only as good as the inputs. So this is why it's key to understand prompt engineering, which is simply a fancy term for the quality of your prompts or your inputs. For example, if I simply write on ChatGPT, how can I grow on YouTube? The answer I'll get is pretty generic and quite vague. And to be honest, it's information that I probably already know. So instead, use this particular framework to make your answers even better. And that is context, task, goal, format, and tone. This will make your answers a lot more detailed and a lot more relevant to your needs. Let's use the same example again using this framework. So I've gone ahead and updated my prompt using all five different elements from the framework. So I've started with some context. I currently have 1,000 subscribers on YouTube and my goal is to grow to 10,000 within the next six months. And that is the declaration of my goal. Then I've gone on to say, my niche is teaching tutorials and my best performing videos are related to Excel. So I've given ChatGPT a little bit more context about my channel. Then I go on to say, create a content strategy for my channel to help me reach my goal of 10,000 subscribers. Now that is the specific task that I'm asking ChatGPT to do for me. Then finally, I say write it in an article format, which is the format itself. And then for the tone, I've said in a concise and clear tone. And of course, you can make this as detailed as possible. The more detail you give it and more information you give ChatGPT, the better your answers will be. Let's now enter this on ChatGPT and see what happens. So I've entered in the prompt and I've pressed enter. So as you can see, it's saying congratulations on 1000 subs. Now it's giving me more specific information I can see already compared to the previous example. So it's telling me to double down on what works, expand my horizons, engage with the audience, collaborate with other creators, optimize, consistency and conclusion. Now again, as you can see, this is definitely more tailored than what I saw before. I can already see Google Sheets, it's referencing to Excel. So it's definitely taken my prompt and come up with a much more constructive answer. Again, I wouldn't say it's perfect, but it's definitely a good start and a lot better than what I had before, which is way too generic. So hopefully that's been useful. And as you can see, ChatGPT is a powerful tool if you use it correctly and if you use the right prompts to give you the right answer. But until next time, don't forget to keep upskilling yourself and subscribe to the channel and hit the like button for more content.